Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to solve algebraic equations for rectangles. Now, there's two kinds of rectangles, usually for which there are equations that are more uh, popularly used, so uh, we're going to talk about the first one and go from there. Now, one popular formula for rectangles is the perimeter, which is p is equal to 2l plus 2w. Now, a lot of it depends on what kind of information that you're given, but if you wanted to solve for, let's just say, length, it's just like any other algebra equation that you want to get it by itself. So if you want to get L by itself, you want to go ahead and move the 2W term over. Since it's you're adding 2W, you want to subtract 2, 2W on both sides. So you have P minus 2W is equal to 2L. And then to solve for L, get L on its own, you divide both sides by 2. So you have L is equal to 2, p minus 2w over 2. Now if you like, you can split it up into two separate terms. p over 2 minus 2w over 2, and l is equal to p over 2 minus w. Now, the other one is actually a lot more straightforward, is that the area formula for rectangle, which is going to be a is equal to lw. Now let's just say if I wanted to solve for width, it's actually a pretty simple operation because if I want to get w by itself, I want to get rid of the l. Now the length is multiplied with w, so we go with the opposite operation. So divide both sides by the length. The lengths cancel. So you have w is equal to a, which is the area, divided by the l, which is the length. So basically, as long as you know what the perimeter and area formulas are, you should be good to go when it comes to solving the algebraic equations using rectangles. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's solving algebraic equations using rectangles.